Good afternoon YouTube, it's Mighty Grimlock. I am back again with another video for you and today I am doing it from my couch! Yes, I've finally done away with my old dodgy webcam and I now have a nice little shiny camcorder and now I can record anywhere I like. So I thought, why not do it in the comfort of my own living room rather than sitting on my computer chair over there. I decided to sit on my lovely couch and be nice and comfortable. But you're not really here to hear me talking about comfortable couches. At least I don't think you are. I could always start up a new channel reviewing couches. You're here to hear me talking about Transformers, and that's what I'm going to do today. Today I'm looking at another one of my AA purchases, and that mighty bot is... Solar Storm Grapple! I have no idea why he's called Solar Storm Grapple. I can only presume it's due to Hasbro not being able to name a toy after a word in the dictionary. But as well as adding Solar Storm onto the beginning of his name, they also misspelled Grapple, which kind of makes me wonder why they even bothered putting Solar Storm at the beginning in the first place. If simply misspelling the word avoids copyright, and they could have just took a leaf out of Sensi Soccer's book. Anyway, this is Grapple, and he is utterly gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful bot. Um, a lovely, lovely vehicle mode. Lovely vehicle mode. This mode has come in quite a few different flavours. Hotspot, Inferno, Art Fire, Ice Cream Truck, not forgetting Autobot Spark, um, which I did. But this is the one that I got anyway, and for 15 quid, I think this was an absolute steal because he is gorgeous. In this mod, there's a bit to talk about, I suppose. There's some nice detail on him, a nice bit of paint apps, although he is missing quite a lot. Anton did tell me to get the Repro labels, and that is something that I'm planning to do at some point. I can never actually be bothered to get the Repro labels. But he has some paint apps, and he has some nice little bits, and he rolls really well. Which is always good fun. He also has his little crane arm, which goes up and down, and in and out, and the hook moves as well. So, you can't really argue with that. It's good fun. It's just clean good fun. I don't think there's anything else I need to say about this mode, other than it's awesome. Transformation time. transformation is actually really quite intuitive and quite easy but it's also quite a lot of fun at the same time except for this bloody arm which pops off all the time but what a bot mode we are left with ladies and gentlemen he looks beautiful and he is very very well detailed there's not too much kibble anywhere except for this bit on his arm and he's basically gorgeous basically he's just gorgeous basically 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 gorgeous gorgeous Grapple also has an absolutely gorgeous head sculpt, which is offset quite nicely by what would be some lovely light piping. It would be lovely, except they've painted over the eyes in blue paint, and it doesn't really work very well. It's kind of like buying a house with a beautiful view, only to smear the windows in Vaseline. In terms of articulation, this guy has quite a lot. Swivelly and rotatey feet. Awesome knee hinge. Rotatey legs. Ratchety shoulders. Always good. He has outward motion on his arms, and his elbows bend as well. Also, his head's on a ball joint, which I believe is the only ball joint in his body. When Grapple's not busy trying to put roofs on pointless buildings with no windows or doors to speak of, he can be found at the local fishing pond, which is one of his favourite pastimes. Pretty handy that he's got a built-in fishing rod, eh? Not me. Not like this. The thing I like most about this Grapple is he sort of harks back to, to a bygone era. The front of his truck is his chest. There's no hidden stupid fake chests or anything. He is full on chunktastic and his transformation is quite simple, almost G1-esque. There are insane amounts of detail moulded into him all over his body and he looks absolutely fantastic. So is Grapple worth getting? Absolutely. Right, this has been Mighty Grimlock and this has been my first ever video on my new camera. I hope it's been alright. I'm going to have to have a bit of a play about and find some better angles I believe, but not bad start, I don't think. Anyway, yes. I shall return soon because now I have my camera I can start doing proper videos and there's one person in particular I'm quite looking forward to reviewing.
So until next time, everybody, bye!